I would just like to say before the video starts, credit to all these modders out there in FS19 that created these mods. I take no credit for building these mods. I just converted them over to Farming Simulator 22. So let's get in, right into the video. Yo, what's up guys? Buckle Modding here today. We have three mods to showcase for you guys here today. These are all three public mods. So uh, you can check these three mods out in the description of this video. And uh, yeah, make sure to like and subscribe this video and uh, comment. And, uh, so uh, let's start out here with the Ford F. So it has a nice detailed interior. We have the Super Duty emblem right there. It looks like a Lariat interior, I'm pretty sure. Um, the mirrors work, which is pretty cool. And uh, let's fire this baby up. So it looks like it has the Expendables modding logo on the screen. Then it loads up to whatever the the thing is, the screen. Looks like the mirrors are bugging out, but it doesn't really bother me. So this is the 4x4 model. It has um, nice mud flaps on it. Nice detailed um, mud flaps on it. The um, person I got this mod off of said the suspension was a little bit soft so um if you guys download this just be aware so um here's the options for this truck all right we're into the shop here so we got two different um sus suspension here for you so we got like a tow a tow suspension pack and just regular um, when you do get this towing suspension, it you have much stiffer suspension, which is good for towing and hauling stuff. And this is just going to be your normal uh, soft suspension. You have BF Good Rich um, All Train Tires, which looks pretty good on this truck. We have um, Off Road Tires. And we have muddy tires. And I'm pretty sure that's all the options until we go back to stock. We have um, the bumpers with without the deflector. We can go color coded, um, an off road bumper, and go back to the normal design. We can have stock steps, we have foldable steps, and off road steps. You can put a plow mount on there if you want. You can do 4x4 design, an FX4 design, the squad dash, not sure what that means, the squad 4x4, squad FX4, the squad rear, which adds the squad license plate, the squad, and then like everything with it, squad rear 4x4, the squad both 4x4, squad rear FX4, and uh, the expendables rear license plate. Expendables both, Expendables rear 4x4, Expendables both 4x4, Expendables both FX4, and then goes back to stop. So we have a lot of design options for this truck. We got another design, selectable right here, and go um, a digital camo wrap, and then I'm pretty sure it goes back to stock. You can go a fixed hitch adjustable drop hitch fixed hitch with gooseneck fixed hitch with er, an adjustable hitch with gooseneck and then no attachments it goes back to stock you have a 6.7 power stroke, stroke v8 tune and then just a normal power stroke v8 stock we have Multiple color options here. You got a light blue. You can go black. You can go gray. A bunch of different options for you here. And then the design color. I'm not pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that don't do anything. I'm not sure you guys will have to play around with it. And then the rim color. Um, so 
anything. Yeah, everything's basically um, shiny and stuff, so looks pretty good on basically any dark or light setting. On to the next mod. Okay, next mod is this Polaris Ranger 800 or 900. I converted this over from FS19 to 22, and it has custom uh, Ranger sounds on it. And it might need scaled up a little bit, so uh, tell me in the comments if it needs scaled up, and I will do so. So let's hop right into this. Oops, wrong vehicle. Let's fire up. Has nice detailed um, back and front. And it goes pretty fast for a Ranger too. So uh, let's get into the options for this. Okay, the only options for this 2019 Players Ranger is the colors. There's nothing um, really detailed into this Ranger besides, you know, the headlights need a little bit fixed. But either than that, everything's good on this. You have a lot of color options to go by. And then you can go blue, dark blue, you can do yellow, purple, basically whatever color your guys' ranger is at home or any IRL stuff you can have. You can go black. I mean, basically any color you want. And that'll also change the A-arms and the suspension with it too. Okay, our next mod is another conversion by me, an RZR Turbo 1000. This is um, my very first convert, and I love this mod to death. It's a really nice mod, very detailed. Um, we got the custom rims on it. We have the, like the little handlebar right there. Almost everything you can ask for. Let's fire this baby up. Sounds pretty good. This thing is really fast off to the start, so if you guys don't like it, you have to kind of touch the throttle a little bit and then let it really rip. Now this mod does have just a little bit of suspension, but you have to slow down when you turn or else it's just gonna slide. So let's jump into the store and see the options for this baby. So we're in the store now. And so basically everything, two options is the collars, the chains, rim collars, suspension collars, roll bar, plastics, a lot of that stuff. My personal favorite is probably the all blacked out one. You have three wheel options, the aftermarket ones, and then these race ones. I like them. This is um, pretty nice. I love this one, so uh, make sure to download this one. Download with this one in the description. So, guys, thanks for watching this mod review, and um, I'll see you guys in the next one.